What's up everyone? This is Bullshot, back again with another Call of Duty Mobile video. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. So in today's video I am going to be covering two high performance loadouts for the brand new ISO to use inside of this new Season 7 Battle Royale update. One of these loadouts will be based solely on the hipfire performance and the other build is going to be based on a hybrid playstyle. Both of these two loadouts are currently performing pretty amazing in close to medium range engagements, having little to absolutely zero recoil and incredibly optimized range of damage. Now, if this is your first time here in my channel, then make sure to press the subscribe button and turn on post notifications and be sure to press the like button, which is absolutely free for you, but extremely helpful for my channel. And please make sure to hit the like button below, as this helps me a lot to make contents like this for you. Anyways, with that being said, let's get right into the video. The ISO is a more traditional submachine gun, with a high rate of fire, medium range of damage, and higher than average mobility. The overall recoil of this weapon is low for a SMG, going up and drifting to the right, similarly to the BP-50. In terms of mobility, the base variant of the ISO has several of the same stats of the QQ-9, including movement speed, sprint speed, and the aim down sight speed. The ISO overall serves as an alternative of the QQ-9, with worse close-up damage in exchange for better DPS over range. Anyways, first, I am going to be covering the close-range hipfire build for the ISO, which is compatible with every single variant of this submachine gun. It will be a full-fledged close-range build, which is created specially for the QQ-9 users. This build has an amazing combination of hipfire accuracy and ammunition capacity, and it also has some incredibly optimized mobility as well. Anyways, let's start with the MIP Light Flash Guard, which will improve the hipfire and the ADS accuracy of this build. The MIP laser will increase the hipfire accuracy and reduce the sprint to fire delay of this build. I am using the Merc 4 grip, which will reduce the vertical recoil and further improve the hipfire accuracy of this build. I am using the 50 rounds drum magazine in the ammunition section, which will increase the ammunition capacity by extra 30 rounds with the cost of overall mobility. And lastly, I am using the ISO collapsible stock, which will improve the overall mobility of this build. Overall, this is a pretty effective custom loadout of this submachine gun to use inside of this season's Battle Royale. It is greatly optimized for close range engagements and believe me on this, the hipfire accuracy you are going to achieve with this loadout is just on another level. For the mods with this custom ISO build, I am recommending you to use the long range mods, the extended magazine mods, and the hip fire boost mods to get the most effective results possible. Anyways, with that being said, let's get right into some gameplay action, and I'll be catching you in the next gunsmith segment pretty quickly. Supply drop inbound. Supply drop incoming. Your teammate has been killed. Airdrop has been delivered. Draft deployed. Voidwalker activated. Major instability detected. Back to safe zone. And now, I am going to be covering the second gunsmith loadout of the ISO, which is created specifically for a hybrid play style. This is a high accuracy suppressed loadout, which can flawlessly go against some of the most powerful close range weapons inside of the battle royale. And after equipping the mods alongside this loadout, you are going to achieve an aimbot like accuracy, which is almost as precise as weapons like the QQ9 or the B50. Anyways, let's start with the tactical dominator barrel which will increase the damage range and the bullet velocity of this build. The MIP laser will increase the hip fire accuracy and reduce the sprint to fire delay of this build. I'm using the Merc 4 grip, 
which will reduce the vertical recoil and improve the hip fire accuracy of this build. I am using the 50 rounds drum magazine in the ammunition section, which will increase the ammunition capacity by extra 30 rounds with the cost of overall mobility. And lastly, I am using the monolithic suppressor, which will increase the overall range of damage of this build. One thing I have to say for the QQ9 users, this is a heavily effective custom gunsmith loadout to use inside of the Battle Royale. It is greatly optimized for close to medium engagements, and trust me when I say, the precision quality you are going to achieve with this loadout is just on another level. For the mods with this custom gunsmith build, I am recommending you to use the extended magazine mods, the long range mods, and the hip fire boost mods to get the most effective results possible. Here are some high quality gameplay of me using with this ISO build. Enjoy! Major instability protection. Evac to safe zone. Net call. Supply drop incoming. Airdrop. Your team made it to the camp. Only two teams left. Getting close to victory. Airdrop. Your team made it to the Your teammate has been killed. Your teammate has been Supply drop inbound. 